So hi everybody, I'm here with Nick Hills, a Forza's CTO and co-founder, and we're talking about Ava, our vertical AI, and the real business value that she's driving across the consumer goods industry. And one of the key reasons Ava is so differentiated is her use of RAG, or Retrieval Augmented Generation. And we're just going to spend a couple of minutes unpacking that and why it really matters. So hi Nick, how are you doing? Hey Andy, I'm good. Uh, good to be speaking to you about such an important topic. Fantastic. So let's start with the basics. What exactly is retrieval augmented generation and how does it differ from standard large language models? Good question. Um, but let's take it back a step first, right? And talk about the, the problem that RAG solves. So one of the issues that you'll find when using AI is, and I'm sure you've all experienced this, it tends to make stuff up, right? If you ask it a question, it will uh, do something called hallucination because it's really, really eager to give you a response. So if it can't find the right data or if it doesn't know the answer, it tends to just give you a positive response anyway. And if you're just doing you know, some creative writing or you're, you're doing something kind of quite horizontal, that doesn't really matter too much. But when you're talking about enterprise use cases, you're talking about um, business critical systems, obviously if something is inaccurate, that's a massive red flag. That's that's something you just can't have. So that's the issue. That's the problem. Retrieval augmented generation is how LLMs solve that. So now when you ask a question, instead of the LLM having to make something up, you actually give it the tools and capabilities to go and find and search for that data and augment its response with that data. So now it's it's really eager to answer still, but it actually has the tools, the data to to pull from so that when it sends its response, it's using credible, actual information. And so I, mean, I, I feel like you've, you've got into a little bit of this, but why is, why is RAG so important to our customers and you know, when it really comes to the enterprise side of AI? Yeah, so as, as I mentioned, you can't have hallucination, right? That's one of the, the key issues when trying to use AI at scale for enterprise. So, so RAG is a great way of kind of solving that. But it also helps with a few other kind of key areas. So it's not just about the, the accuracy and the relevance. It's making sure you have up-to-date information, right? So typically LLMs, they have kind of a cutoff period in 2024. So if you try and get some up-to-date information, it's going to have that knowledge cutoff of last year. So by using RAG, you can get more up-to-date, um, relevant information you know, from the same day. It also lets your LMs have more contextual understanding. So if you're talking about a, um, a process, a quite a complicated process like trade promotion management, no matter how well that LM has been trained, it's still going to be missing some context, whether that is the, uh, the product you're selling and promoting, whether it's last year's performance, whether it's just your specific business process. By having that retrieval augmented generation, it's going to allow it to collect more context and to answer your question better within the confines of that data. Um, and all of these things put together give you kind of that increased trust, which is really critical for user adoption in enterprise. And also it's going to make them much more efficient. You're going to find that, you know, if it's relying on external data, it actually generates its responses a lot quicker than it would if it's making its uh, stuff up out of uh, thin air. And now a force is entirely dedicated to consumer goods. That's all we do, where we focus. Can you give some examples of, of use cases uh, where RAG's used with Ava today? Yeah, there's, there's two primary areas we use RAG. Um, the first is for something what we call is the commercial coach. That is using Ava to provide you up-to-date information about your company, your sales strategy, your products, your brands, your entire portfolio. Um, and how you as a company, as a manufacturer or distributor, go to market, right? So Ava will use RAG to actually look at your company documentation, your files, whether that is your um, company onboarding document, or it's your product catalog, um, or it's your website, right? It will use that information to give you the correct coaching and advice specific to your company um, and the kind of the niche that you might have or play in as um, you know your your business. The second use case that we support, um, and this is the one we use across all of our different agents, you know, for promotions, for visit execution, whatever it might be, is something called functions. 
And functions are what the LM uses to collect and retrieve that data. So we have a library of functions that Ava has access to, which lets it pull back your trade promotion data, your CRM data, your retail execution data. So whenever you ask a question or want to do some sort of action, whether that is planning a new promotion or um, coming up with the perfect visit execution strategy for a customer, what will happen is Ava will actually look at that information, you know, get your past orders, get your past promotions, get the top performing promotions, and it will use that information to answer your request. So those two combinations really give you a real rich consumer goods enterprise grade solution. Um, and we're seeing a lot of benefit to our customers by, by using that. Fantastic. That all makes total sense. And Nick, I can really see how, you know, Rag adds so much value to Ava and why she can do what she does. So thanks for taking time to explain that. Yeah, no problem. Uh, it's a very interesting topic and um, just one of many things that Ava is very good at doing. Excellent. And again, um, you know, Nick, Nick talked about a lot of things there and, and also the um, Ava, the commercial coach. And so if you like the sound of that and you'd like to see how Ava can add value to your business, head over to our website. Um, either, you know, find the Ava pages where we have the commercial coach or speak directly to Ava on the site and we'll, we'll make sure we can take things forward with you. So thanks for listening and have a great rest of your day.